Hey everybody, just wanted to give you an update here as to what's been going on. Um, it's the end of August 2016 and uh, I've been sort of thinking about my plans here for the next couple of months and uh, I've been living aboard the boat all summer and um, it's, it's been pretty nice, it's worked out pretty good. It's small but uh, you know it's, it's a good feeling and uh, the next step I guess is uh, I'm going cruising. Tentatively I'm going to be leaving at the middle of October. Um, I haven't found a crew member yet. I haven't been really, act really actively looking, but um, I've decided that I'm going by myself and uh, I'm going to be heading down the ICW towards Florida and ultimately cross over to uh, the Bahamas. I like to visit the Exuma chain and cruise around there and then come back up in uh, June, up here, back here to New England. Uh, I've, I retired from the fire service. I, will, I was a big city firefighter here in New England, and uh, it's time to go. I worked all these years to make this happen, bought the boat, refurbished it, uh, refitted it, so I, I just want to go and experience it. Um, some of the, the people that I follow uh, live on small boats and uh, cruise around. One specific example is uh, Lea Lea, sailing vessel Lea Lea with Chuck and Laura uh, Rose. They live aboard a uh, Albin Vega 27. They've been doing this for quite a few years. They seem to have a happy life, so um, I think I'll have no problem sort of doing the same thing on a similar sized boat which is this uh, 28 foot west sail. Uh, some of the other people that sort of have been, you know, my mentors and, ins and inspired me to living this type of lifestyle are uh, Lynn and Larry Party. Um, I I've been reading about them since I was a kid and uh, I've always believed in their simple philosophy. It's sort of like their motto was, uh, go simple, uh, go small, go now. So in a sense, that's, that's what I'm doing. I'm out of the matrix. I'm trying not to uh, to, to work even part time, so I just want to have some freedom and go cruising. I don't know what the future holds, uh, but I, I want to go while I'm still young enough and uh, I have the strength to be able to handle you know this boat by myself if need be. So another thing, if anybody knows of uh, somebody that wants to go uh, be a part of of, of my crew and. Uh, you know, go at least go down the ICW or parts of the ICW and then to the Bahamas and just leave a comment in the, in, in the comment section of this video. I want somebody who's reliable in a sense that doesn't, you know, doesn't have a drug abuse or a drinking problem and uh, can stand a watch and uh, is relatively easy to, to get along with. The sailing part and everything else that really, that's really not my concern as much as having a, um, a reliable person to be with me. So in a sense, that's it. The boat is ready to go. I have to, re I have to buy a, a head rebuild kit because um, I imagine that I, I won't have that available once I leave the mainland U.S. But uh, that's really about it. I have to part buy the... Uh, the Explore Our Chart series for the Bahamas and then uh, a, a chart booklet from Norfolk, Virginia to uh, Florida. So that's about it for now, just giving you an update and um, thank you for watching. Talk to you soon.